welcome back to my MLB 18 franchise with the New York Mets. This is episode 26. If you guys are caught up with the playlist on my channel, um, I know I haven't been playing as much. I apologize. It's hard to maintain three different series. And what I mean by that is my MLB, NBA, and my Madden franchises. So I'm going to try to go through it as fast as possible. I'm going to do one game a week, maybe even one game every two weeks. Um, <coughs> so keep an eye out for that. But if you're new, subscribe. Uh, click that notification bell to make sure it's holding and follow the new video. If you like what you see, smash the thumbs up button. I'm trying to get at least two to five likes. It tells me you want to see more videos just like MLB Franchise. I'll leave in the comments below. Alright, so now all that talking is out of the way. Here I am for this June 18th team against Colorado. We are 46 and 24. They are 31 and 40. Uh, no Senate guards in the mound. Going for his 11th win. <clears throat> We're going to be in Colorado, so maybe. Um, the elevated, uh, the elevation is going to help us a little bit, and, yeah. <clears throat> jerseys, on, and that should be it, yeah, let's take a look at the lineups here, I'm going to take a Rosario, put in, <clears throat> I'm going to put in Gavin, that's a leader spot, there's no, there's no bottom too much right now, um, but we're going to have, uh, Sacchini, Astrubal Cabrera, Michael Cafori, Yuan Cespedes, Todd Frazier, uh, Charles Darnell, Juan Lavares, Suena Flores, and Noah Syndergaard. Um, <clears throat> there's somebody I actually want to add here because I know they're missing me. Well, since he's already over, since he's gone basically. I might keep David right in for the rest of the season, just for respect. Um, <clears throat> his last few years as a man, I was really a fan of because he was so injured. It's not his fault, his body was broken on him, but um, I might, I might just keep him as a starting third baseman, just because, no disrespect to Todd Frazier, but David Wright, the captain of the Mets, I hope he stays with him in some way or form, but uh, yeah, I'm going to have him play third base this game, and I might keep him there whenever I play the video, so yeah. <clears throat> Oh, and that is a moonshot. Get that at, out of here. Woo, that is out of here in a, in a hurry. Get going 448 feet for his 20th home run of the season. Jonas Cespedes makes a 2 0 Mets here in the first inning with two outs. It was a full count, it was just up there, so we decided to just jump on it. We got lucky. As soon as you made contact, it was a no doubter. That's a base hit by David Wright. That is back to back hits for the Mets in the first inning. And the captain's on board. And that's a missed uh, dive. Davis gonna round third. Darno's gonna round second, and he's gonna try to round home. And oh no, he's caught. He is caught. But David Wright scores on that play. That's a triple by Travis Darno, and that's an RBI. But the big highlight was his home run by Yoannis Cespedes. Three and two to DJ Lemayhew. We add it first. <clears throat> we'll take a look at the lineups here for the Rockies. It looks like this. It's DJ LeMahieu, followed Ian Desmond, Charlie Blackman, Nolan Arenado, David Dahl, Trevor Story, Gerardo Parra, Chris Ionetta, and Tyler Anderson in the pitcher spot. <clears throat> Ooh, that's going to be a base hit by Syndergaard. That's going to put Flores to third. Actually, I'm going to send him home. He's going to turn the corner. No, JK. He's way too slow for that. But that is a double by Noah Syndergaard driving at the opposite field. Wow. Getting a swing on in Colorado. Zero. 
And that's a strikeout for Noah Syndergaard. That is that another home run for Ioannis? He drives it to deep center field. And it is out of here. That is the second home run of the game. Going 452 feet, even farther than his previous home run. Again, driving in Conforto. Now it is 5-0 Mets here in the third inning with the one out. With three one county, just got a hold of it. Right into center field, into the crowd. That is off the wall, actually, by Lagares. He's pushing it to third. Darno's home, man. He is safe. Oh, shoot. <laughs> I sent him home by accident, but that is actually a triple by Lagares. And that's the end of the inning. That's a swing and a miss, and the ball game is over. The Mets win 7 to 3 here in Colorado to end their losing streak. It's all supported by the bats of Jonas Cespedes, the entire team basically. Uh, I think we had 13 hits, they had 11, gave it too many hits though. Um, but Noah Syndergaard gets his 11th win, Jonas Cespedes has 4 RBIs with 2 home runs. And hopefully he can turn things around for the Mets and maybe win a few more games. Alright, so what I was going to do is choose this game against... Dodgers. Let's see who is going to be pitching. Well, so we won the first, the next game after uh, that. The Grom's 13th win. This even match lost 5 to 7. Arietta lost 1 to 3. Lost to the Dodgers. Zach Wheeler. The Mets beat Dodgers for nothing, and it's going to be. Jacob DeGrom versus Clayton Kershaw. That is Battle of the Behemoths in pitching. So I'm excited about it. They are 48 and 27. We are 49 and 27. So this should be very interesting. Clayton Kershaw, 8 and 4. Um, and Jacob DeGrom, 13 and, 13 and 1 with a 2.37 ERA. Um, so this should be very interesting. And uh, yeah, let's see. Let's see. Um, the award so far. So we got Bryce Harper trying to beat at Yoannis for M uh, MVP. Jacob deGrom is basically a type of Noah Syndergaard for uh, Cy Young. And Coach Schmidt, of course, he's a great hitter. But yeah, uh, let's see who else is still in my... Uh, okay, no, I created just Jose Reyes. Who's also probably on the way out. But hope you guys enjoyed this episode of my um, my franchise, the New York Mets. Again, I'm sorry I'm a little behind. Uh, I'm going to try to finish the season out. Uh, we're playing at least one game a week. And providing you some with some more episodes. And yeah, so click that like up, the, like up, the thumbs up button. And uh, I'm trying to get at least 1,500 subscribers. I'm at 1,419 right now as I check. And uh, hopefully... I can reach that soon, so support my channel, and thank you so much, hope you guys have a great day, take it easy, and peace.